we have a thermometer with spoiled batteries the low battery indicator has been flashing for some time now and now the display has gone blank so let's see what kind of batteries we have in here and what condition they are in I hope they're not door so they're not they are uh, Amazon's complicated and the batteries are in good condition they have failed safely these batteries have a expiration of of uh, 2030 which is quite a ways into the future so um, uh, that's you know they're not past the expiration however we've seen Doracell leak way before the expiration so I am not either endorsing or uh, deterring purchase of these batteries I have not used them enough to say I bought a few of them a Christmas or two ago because I needed some for candles and they worked fine for all the candles I've had a couple left after that so I've been putting them in miscellaneous things like thermometers and they've been working fine I really don't use alkaline batteries I don't like them it was very rare that I purchased them in that case uh, I don't like that they're single use I don't like that they can leak so I just typically don't use them but this is kind of a rare case that I I used them as soon as I had them so they failed safely so that's good so now I'll put some uh, nickel metal hydride batteries in here and these batteries uh, I need to get some new ones these are getting old I've had these batteries for quite a few years now I'd say at least five or six years and I'm noticing they don't hold the charge that well anymore so it's time to order some new nickel metal hydride batteries and I can keep using these for the thermometers and things like that which are very low draw I should get at least a month or two out of them in this thing uh, and these have a button cell battery that keeps the time and the date which is very handy so this has picked up the uh, outdoor transmitter again and the low battery icon is now appearing in the outdoor transmitter so it might be time to to check out those batteries and replace those it tends to go bad once the weather gets cold but I think I'll leave it in there and let it keep operating until it it becomes so low that it doesn't work because sometimes that low battery comes and goes it's been coming and going for like a month or two now so I'll just leave it until it stops